this. Let's talk about this. I've spoken about this, I, a, a stock that I've owned that I want to get rid of because I find it very difficult to use their app. However, hundreds of thousands of other people don't have a problem with it. Everything the app is associated with, I'm not. So I don't want to, I don't want to hold on to the shares of the stock. However, I did hold on to them after the company reached out and made an offer to me, a tender offer to buy my common shares, my A common shares, or I should, should I say common A shares, I'll show you in a moment, for $10 and I said no. And I took a chance to see what would happen. And it was good news. I came home tonight, I did a little research, I said, wow, I'm so happy. I screenshot this because I didn't want to show my account. This is in my Fidelity account. They give you updates of the stocks, you know, the, the companies you invest in. And if you remember my last video, I was waiting for this VPC Impact Acquisition Holdings to merge with Backed Holdings and they're going to have their meeting tomorrow. I'm really, before I read the paragraph, I'm really happy I held on to them because my cost per share is 1237. I own 275 of them. Their 52 week high is 2256. And I believe after this merger and everything goes to plan, I'll read that paragraph to you in a moment. I believe it's going to go over 2256. And then I'm going to sell five at a time, sell off the ones I paid the most for, and work my way down and give, give my, get back my money, but I truly believe with a profit. And why do I say that? Oops. Uh, because... It says the transaction is expected to generate gross proceeds of more than 447 million, including an expected 325 million in committed funding from a private investment in public equity or PIPE. PIPE is private investment in public equity, financing and about 122 million from VPC Impact's trust account. The combined company's Class A common shares, I own Class A common shares. I, I, when I called, I believe that's what they told me. I'm learning as I'm going. And redeemable warrants, I've had experience with warrants. You can buy shares of a stock at a lower price for a short amount of time and then that's so the company can um, attract more investors but increase their capital and then you sell them off but with, with a warrant like say if you have 200 warrants those 200 warrants will be turned into a common share. I do have some experience with that. They are expected to begin trading on the New York Stock Exchange on October 18th under the symbols BKKT and BKKT, BKKT WS respectively. VPC Impact is a special purpose acquisition company sponsored by investment firm Victor Victory Park Capital. Victory Park Capital. Sorry, guys. Victory Park Capital. But I've been watching this and watching it. It was a learning experience. I didn't take the offer. I didn't lose my shares. And after reading this, this came out today. I am crossing my fingers in the next month or so. 
that it surpasses 2256 and I'll get my money back with a profit gained more of a financial education I just if I can't use the app myself I've had a difficult time since the beginning I'm tired of trying but other people it works for obviously or they want to be doing business together for some reason it just don't work for me so I want my money back I don't want to continue to invest in a company and in this app that's not working so I'm gonna keep my eye on this oops huh. and um, I'm hoping I mean I'm hoping it hits forty and fifty dollars that'll be some return on investment I would be very pleased with that I could take a deep breath and yeah, I, I gained a lot of financial education by doing this. Investing is a gamble, and I took a gamble. Instead of falling for the fear, I learned. I read the white paper over and over and over again. I called up Fidelity. I asked them for, I asked them questions. They're not allowed to tell you what to do, but they can answer your questions. And I'm really happy I hung in there because I believe the return on investment is going to quadruple my original investment you know my cost per share is twelve dollars and thirty seven cents I hope it breaks forty or fifty bucks that would be incredible and then I'll start selling them off so stay tuned for future videos I'll let you know eventually when I cash out I'll do a video because I want to I want to show people how I'm going to sell off the ones I paid the most for and do five at a time and I believe the cost per share will go up while I'm doing it and I'm going to do five at a time and sell those 275 shares and get my money back with a profit okay I'll see you soon folks have a good one hope you enjoyed the video